you will see their arguments. No one, method number one, the water level in the Sea of Galilee. And method number two, a day like a year, a day like a month, a day like a week. Who are Gog and Magog? Are they funny looking people or are they normal human beings? Huh? To answer that question, we have to locate a people who prior to Wailul Arab, prior to the time of the Prophet Muhammad had no special links with the Holy Land. But after the Prophet Muhammad are now obsessed with liberating the Holy Land. Only one people qualify. It's Europe. Europe after the Prophet Muhammad embarks upon the Crusades. It's the white people doing it, the European. It's not an essentially Christian phenomenon. Why? Because no other Christians are involved in the Crusades, only Europe. So the Crusades are an essentially European phenomenon masquerading as Christianity. Secondly, the obsession with the Holy Land continues with the Zionist movement. But the Zionist movement is European. But it is masquerading as Jewish. How do we know that? No other Jews are involved in the effort to liberate the Holy Land, only the European. Hmm? And then finally, we have the island of Britain, which is now secular and godless. But this Britain now issues the famous Balfour Declaration in 1917 that it is the intention of the British government to work for the establishment of a Jewish national home in the Holy Land. This is strange. I think I told you the only thing stranger than this ever happened in history was when the cow jumped over the moon. <laughs> huh? This strange obsession on the part of Europe for liberating the Holy Land, which they eventually did in 1919, indicates that Gog and Magog are located in European civilization. We can refine it even more than that. We can be specific within European civilization. Because the Hadith is that when Gog and Magog are released, the first of them will pass by the Sea of Galilee and start to drink the water. And by the time the last of them pass, they'll say, there used to be water here. Who are they who are drinking the water from the Sea of Galilee? Not the Egyptians, not the Jordanians, not the Syrians. Who? Israel. <coughs> who in Israel? Not Banu Israel, the European. It is the European Jew who controls the state of Israel. And it is he who has established the modern economy, which is drinking the water, the industrial economy. That's where the water is going. And it is he as the government of Israel who has established the policy of making the deserts green. You need a lot of water to do that. So we can identify Gog and Magog not only in Europe, but also in that part of Europe which is Jewish. Hmm?